Namaste, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you may be across the planet, around the world. My name is Greg Prescott from In5D.com and In5D.net. And today we're going to be talking about the quantum financial system. Okay, so let's just jump right into it. According to this one particular, well, I'll, I'll say what it is, liar, who hides behind the fictitious name of Wolverine, on September 25th, 2023, I'm taping it right now at 7.03 p.m. Eastern. So as of today, they're saying, this guy, Wolverine, at 12 p.m. midnight, London time, which is 7 p.m. Eastern and 4 p.m. Pacific, all money will be deposited into the quantum financial system, the QFS. By the time many of you see this video, that time would have already passed. It's already passed right now. It's 7.03 p.m. when I'm making this video, uh, Eastern time. My question to you and to this blowhard is how many times do we have to hear blowhards like this lie to us? You know, I'm all for hope, but I have very little tolerance for being lied to. And I mentioned this when I called out those lying about the emergency broadcast system BS upcoming on October 4th. You know, the glass is always half full unless it's half full of bullshit then it's really an empty glass full of broken promises and that's what we have here so let's roll the tape here's the man who's hiding behind the fictitious name of wolverine telling us all about this hot air and bullshit hi guys it's wolvie here guys it is monday morning guys it's around about uh, 8 25 Guys, just letting you know that at uh, 12 midnight, London time, London time, worldwide, all money will be deposited into the quantum financial system. All money. Okay, just get ready, guys. Okay, so you heard that right. Midnight, London time, all money will be deposited on the quantum financial system. All right, guys, you have a great day. I love you guys and take care. Bye bye. All money will be deposited on the quantum financial system. I asked the AI on Google Bard and ChatGPT about the origins of the quantum financial system. ChatGPT said this, the term quantum financial system, QFS, appears to have originated in various conspiracy theories and fringe discussions online. It's not associated with any legitimate financial institution, organization, or concept within mainstream finance. And then Google Bard said this, the origin of the term quantum financial system, QFS, is unclear. It's first mentioned in a 2018 article by David Wilcock, a conspiracy theorist and new age author. Wilcock claims that the QFS is a new financial system that is being developed by a secret group of people who are trying to liberate humanity from the control of the cabal. And then it goes on, blah, 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 yada, 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 you know, uh, da, 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 whatever else they have to say about this crap. And they finish up by saying, if you are interested in learning more about the QFS, I recommend that you do your own research and be critical of the information of the information that you find. And that's exactly what I did. The earliest reference I could find regarding QFS is from May 25th, 2010. And of course, the fictitious Nasara and blabbermouth Charlie Ward are mentioned in this article full of hot air and bullshit. This is from 2010, 13 years ago, and has absolutely zero basis for credibility. Yet 13 years later, it's still being pushed by liars such as the man who hides behind the name of Wolverine. I wonder if he's going to apologize to his followers for lying to them. I doubt it. 
for the past several days on Twitter, there's been a flooding of rainbow currency posts. Check it out. Thank God for the internet because here's a post from November 12th, 2012, 11 years ago, saying a new U.S. Treasury rainbow currency will come into being backed by gold, silver, and platinum precious metals. A new Treasury bank system will be initiated, blah, 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 yada, yada, yada. And here we have the same bullshit being pushed four years later in 2016. And now, seven years later, the same crap is being pushed. And this is what I want to ask you, the viewer. Is it possible that the quantum financial system, Nasara, and the flat earth theory are all psyops designed to distract us all from what's really going on? That's called smoke and mirrors. Look over here at this shiny new currency while all this other shit's going on over here that will eventually take away our civil liberties and freedom because we're distracted by lies and unprovable bullshit. Yeah, that's very possible. As a matter of fact, it's more likely that it's highly probable than anything else. You'll find the same people with their echo chambers of friends all regurgitating the same unprovable crap over and over again. And I don't have to name names. If they're pushing the SARA or the QFS, then you know they're full of bullshit. This video will stand the test of time. 10, 20, 30 years from now, when they're still pushing the SARA, JASARA, and the QFS, feel free to come back and visit this video. I'm not going to say I told you so, and if I'm wrong, I'll make a video apologizing to everyone, but I seriously doubt that, that the reverse will happen. They've lied so long to so many people that they can't back out of it. How many more years will people continue to buy their bullshit? There's a lot of things to be hopeful for. And some of it's not provable, such as what Dolores Cannon says about the new earth and what will happen when the event occurs. I've seen and felt what will happen during the event. White light will flood the earth. And when it happens, all you feel is this unconditional love to a magnitude never experienced before on this planet. And the best way I can describe it is to imagine the person that you love the most, multiply that by a million times, and I'm probably underestimating it, a million times that love, and that's, what the, that's the kind of love that you're going to feel when the white light hits the planet. All third dimensional issues, your boss is a jerk, money, government, politics, religion, none of that stuff matters anymore. All that matters is the love that you're going to be basking in when that happens. I've had other people corroborate my vision as well. One of these people is a registered nurse who had a near-death experience and went to the other side of the veil where she was shown exactly what I had seen and felt. But the difference is, I'm not making a promise or stating this as fact, like Nasara, Jasara, QFS. It's just my experience and I believe in it. All I'm doing is sharing that experience with others. We all feel like we're on the precipice of something that's really big and it's about to happen any minute now. There's almost like an electricity in the air or a sense of knowing something before it happens. And that's where we're at right now. There are exciting days ahead and a lot to be hopeful for. Just be careful who you listen to and follow. Always use your own discernment. And if it smells like bullshit, then chances are it is. I love you all and will always stand in the vibration of truth, love, and light. So until the next time, I'm sending you all infinite love and light from my heart to yours. Namaste, everyone.